Guys, I, I think somebody's stalking me. Like a dude? No, like, there's a girl stalking me. Dean. Yeah, don't flatter yourself. But, I mean, it's sweet. That Guys, you, seriously, there's somebody you stalking me. That you think that. No, 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 um, somebody's actually Dean. stalking me. Hi. Oh my gosh, Sarah, she's right here. Oh. She's right here. My stalker. Oh, um, she was just right there. Dean. Yeah, sure. Guys, guys, she's right there. She's right there. There's my stalker. She's right. Dude, I don't see anybody. Dean. Oh. I, I, I think it's sweet that you think that someone like you that's stalking you that's really that's very good Man, I can't believe they don't believe me about this stalker oh my gosh what are you doing in my car Yeah, me too. Poor kid's got a lot of, a lot of stress, a lot on his mind. Yeah. Guys, I had a date last night. Oh. With what? what? With my stalker. I, but the problem is, is I can't really hold her hand, so. Oh. What's that? What's that? Read Galatians 6, 11 through 18. So, um, in Galatians chapter 6, verses 11 through 18, Paul is finishing out the last part of the whole book of Galatians, and he makes a big point in it to say that he is writing this last part in his own handwriting, and, and largely, in large print, because um, more than likely, he had a scribe writing things out for him like he would dictate it it was paul's word inspired by the holy spirit but it was um his words and then a scribe or somebody was writing it down for him but at the end of this letter he wanted to make a big point of writing it in his own handwriting and in large print because he wanted them to like impress upon them the importance of them remaining faithful to the gospel of god so Paul again points out how others, um, other people had been wanting the Galatians um, to be circumcised, not because they were genuinely, genuinely concerned for their spiritual well-being for the people of Galatia, but because they were more concerned with the outward show being made. And so, and also the, they wouldn't be persecuted for the cross of Christ. Paul points out that others are wanting them to be circumcised so that they may boast in their flesh and not in the spirit. Paul makes it so clear and emphasizes the fact that he has nothing to boast in except for the cross of Christ. By saying that the world has been crucified to him and he to the world, basically Paul is saying that the entire world system is in opposition to God. It's dead or destroyed in its power to attract to him. He's saying that the world has no influence or power over him, also that it has no appeal to him, because Paul serves, Paul serves Christ as his new master. He's not enticed to the desires and, and or the attractions that the world has to offer. Paul goes on to say that being circumcised or not being circumcised is not the main point of all this. The most important thing is being a new creation in Christ. He said that peace and mercy will be upon those who walk by the rule of the Spirit. Paul goes on to explain that he has suffered for Jesus Christ. So as we finish up our study in the book of Galatians, it's important to remind ourselves daily that not only are we saved by grace through faith alone, but our daily sanctification process is also through grace alone. We must rely on the Holy Spirit to guide our lives in our daily choices 
as our purpose is to glorify God.